the Isle of Men, Conan Exiles mod blah, 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 modded map. Get your teeth in, Ferdy. Yeah, this was a good map. I really, really enjoyed it. Um, it's quite hard for me, anyway, and I think I lost my thralls twice uh, in the four streams that I did. My aim, guys, with the map mods is not to show absolutely everything because I don't believe I should spoil it for you. And if you want to go and play the map mod yourself and you've seen it all, there's not much point really, is there? So that is why I'm not going to continue with this in the month of May and we're going to move on to a different map mod. What I've shown, I think, gives you a very good idea of what the map mod is all about. And I'll leave it up to you whether you want to, you know, go and check it out for yourselves. And at least I've not spoiled absolutely everything for you. Enjoy! Oh, there he is. Since my cats uh, are getting quite mobile now and it is summer coming up, they're going to be outside a lot more. So I'm not going to have the kitty cam webcam on as much. And in fact, I'm going to actually invest in a second camera. So you get to see me and when the cats do appear, then I can switch the camera on rather than you looking at a blank screen of the kitty cats. As I said, summer is here and they're spending a lot, lot more time out and about in the garden enjoying themselves and bug catching is one of their new favourite pastimes. I will of course still be streaming from the server and it is currently um, kind of Exiles, the Exiles lands map and next month, I'm sorry my fibro is really bad today. Uh, next month we'll be going over to Sipta, the Isle of Sipta, so I'll be going to continue to do a couple of streams here and there from the server. For those of you who have built awesome bases, yes you know who you are, let me know in Discord when I can come around and have a view and uh, perhaps talk to you and make some little videos so we can showcase your awesome builds on the channel for Conan Exiles Builders Club. Uh, I've done my I don't think I'll be doing any more building on this server. I'm, I don't think I'm going to have the time, to be honest with you. But yeah, let's showcase your builds, guys. And we have Cat World. Yay. I love RimWorld, guys. And for those of you who are new and already subscribed because I play Conan, I play a lot of RimWorld too. So the two main games on my channel are Conan Exiles and RimWorld. I took a little bit of a break from RimWorld, uh, but now I'm back with some more. I will not be getting anomaly one i don't really like it not my kind of thing and two i don't think it has a lot of gameplay i think once you've done everything that's kind of it and i don't kind of really want to waste my money on that but yeah rim world is back uh, with cat world i hope you've all seen this little video the prologue it took me quite a while to do i really really enjoyed making that as well um not all the videos for cat world are going to be like this guys because they do take a lot of work uh, i think the next one is going to be like a little background on the ideology and how we're going to go forward with it that'll be the next video and then after that we might just do a stream and get binks and snow situated in the world barclay's just come to see me haven't you darling um that's why i'm, yeah, I'm stretched out weird <laughs> there you go so yeah rim world is back if you have any ideas or suggestions for future playthroughs on RimWorld stories, uh, then let me know. Tales of the Rim is already on my channel. If you haven't seen them, I've got uh, Lone Wolf and uh, Pratchett's Grove. But we had to give up Pratchett's Grove, unfortunately, because um, it had an update and then all the mods got mashed up and then it got corrupted. So there's a little bit of it, which was quite a good series and I was enjoying playing that. I hope, uh, hope that you're going to enjoy Real World with me too. And uh, yeah, this should be a lot of fun. And now moving on to Kalimdor Exiles. Uh, I've got some updates and some news for you. I enjoyed this map, I really did. And for those of you who don't know what it is, um, it's basically World of Warcraft, the continent of Kalimdor, brought into Colin Exiles, complete with orcs and trolls and blood elves, belves, you name it. Now, it's very, very sad news that the original mod maker, Uruk uh, Sebastian, passed away in March. Sorry, it's just sad. Sorry about that. Try again. The Discord is still up. The mod is still up. However, because he did pass away, 
the the guys who are trying to continue on with the mod can't access certain channels can't access steam where the original mod is uploaded but they are continuing to work on it and i'm going to put the new link to the mod in the description and also the link to the discord uh, in the description as well it's a fantastic mod and the guys are, like i say are continuing to keep up sebastian's work and they're doing an awesome job of it and they've also got other little mods in there as well that you might be interested to do with uh you know world of warcraft merging into conan there's i think there's two or three different ones in there and also there's some awesome news that they're going to be working on northrend as well the little team are working very very hard on this mod and trying to keep it you know at the forefront for you and you know finish it off as much as they possibly can it's just so sad that the young man had to pass away and not be able to continue this himself but it's awesome and absolutely awesome that other people are keeping it up in his stead um i hope you do go and have a look at the new one guys Lots of different changes have been made already and as I say they will continue to finish it off before they move on to other mods to do with the World of Warcraft. So go and join the Discord, keep up to date yourselves with what's going on and I will try my best to keep you updated also. And uh, show these guys some love, um, don't forget they are going through the grieving process right now because he was their friend too. And they need all the support and love they can get so please pop along and uh, try the try the map out yourselves guys it really is good and now for bell right i do like this game i very much enjoyed it so far um i'm not going to do any more on the channel for now i'm going to continue to play it offline to myself because i've got a lot to learn there is a lot to learn to this game and then once i've learned a little bit more in my free time i'll come back and we'll start a brand new stream or series and we've then I'll you know, be able to show you properly what to do and what goes on in the game rather than just me being a total noob at it <laughs> not doing it the game justice that it should have trying to watch me work things out with my stupid fibro brain so yeah give me a chance to go and learn a little bit more about it uh, off camera guys and I'll be back and we'll have another closer look at it uh, as for other things I will continue to use AI artwork I used to be, you know, brilliant at arts. I used to do my own digital art. Check me out on Deviant Arts. I used to be able to do a heck of a lot myself. And I used to spend hours and hours making thumbnails for myself, etc. And I just can't anymore. I don't know if you can see there. But those are my knuckles. Okay. I cannot physically sit here at a computer. For hours and hours on end making my own art anymore i'm sorry to the artists out there that it's affecting i would have been probably one of you as well but i just physically can't sit here and do the things that i used to i have psoriatic arthritis my mobility is very very poor uh i have fibromyalgia my brain is very very poor i am using the tools that i have at hand to be able to do the one and only thing left in my life that i can and that is make videos and, and stream and even that i'm struggling with so people in my comments can get off my ass and get out don't let the door and last but not least neon you've probably seen the little badges like you can see on the screen now all over the place what is neon and what's it all about well we are a group of youtube creators small channels this is what we have so far our little group of merry men it's myself is fear jenny the jedi max and storm we are very much open to getting new members come and join us we have lots of help tips and tricks to grow your youtube channel we've got lots of support we support each other we're chilled out we're not going to nag your ass or anything like that it's just you know a little collective of people who are helping each other to grow their channels and it's working we started in february and so far most of our members because we had a couple of new ones there but myself and fear and i think jenny as well are uh, have been starting to show that we are growing quite quickly and um, for myself i had the biggest subscriber count in seven years just a few months ago and that's when neon started 
so that is what we're all about that is what the thing is about the little badges in the corners uh, so oh. member of the month for may is of course fear uh, so please pop along to his uh, channel drop him a sub go and watch some of his content leave a little, some little comments for him hit the like button on his on his content as well you won't regret it uh fear does a lot of like indie games probably games you've never seen before and games you're probably not likely to see again <laughs> some of them you know they're really funny some of them are quaint and lots of them have jump scares and uh, if you like to see jump scares and spooky stuff then fear's your guy he's quite funny as well guys i enjoy watching him so i hope you do too and if you are a small youtuber come and join us neon is the place to be it really is honest thanks for watching guys see you later